The driver of this Explorer got themselves into a mess after driving through a protected wetland. And now conservation officers are considering severe penalties. Saw um, headlights and heard an engine revving down here in the wetland and we were just up on the hill. Our initial concern was, you know, someone's dumping waste on the property, you know, we have to go catch them. Turned out that it was just a couple joyriding and they had got stuck. So the headlights we saw and the engine that we heard revving was um, someone else trying to tow them out unsuccessfully. Yeah, it's my bad. I just need my boyfriend to help me take my car out. I just got an Explorer. It's my first vehicle. The maximum penalty for the offense uh, could be fines up to $1 million or imprisonment for not more than three years or both. And we don't take this type of activity very lightly. The damage and effect to the environment can be very serious and altering. Mud bogging with off-road vehicles in sensitive wetlands is very serious and it can kill birds, frogs, aquatic life. Damage to the wetlands may impact many generations of wildlife due to the lack of plant life and clean water. Seeing such carelessness and blatant disrespect and the subsequent damage that happened in the blink of an eye to such a beautiful environmentally sensitive area is, as I'm sure you can imagine, quite disheartening. Justice is one thing, but the most important thing is the impact on the environment and seeing that rectified. Now, the owners of the property said that they want to remind the public that this is private property, and they hope that something like this doesn't happen again. For Castanet News, I'm Elena Kelly in Kelowna.